We have a kid we want you to yeah. give a chance to. <laughs> really? Now entering the tank is an entrepreneur who can't spell the word entrepreneur. Oh, he's got no. no ambition, no drive, and he's just here for the money. Please welcome Greg T. the Fred. Greg T. the Fred Boy. Absolutely this scary. Is A real Shark Tank? Absolutely. Here? We need a microphone for Greg T. Uh, Greg T. Barbara Corcoran yes. from Shark Greg, Tank. Greg, yeah. You know what, Barbara? Hi, and Greg, I guess. I've got a little money to invest, too. I'll, I'll, I'll join Barbara on the Oh, you on mean we're 50 50 on what I do? Well, we'll see what happens. We'll, we'll, oh, yeah, I, yeah, I may right. be out. I don't well, know. Well, thank you. You're okay, welcome. Go redhead. Thank you, Sharks. My name is Greg <laughs> T. And my product is the Mr. Office. I am seeking to give you 75% of my company for free. Now, 15 years ago, oh, God. 15 years ago, I was sitting on my toilet doing my business, and it occurred to me I could be doing more business. Today, 25% of all American employees work from home. 93% of all cell phone users text, take calls, or browse social media sites while sitting on their toilets. So that's where I developed the concept for the Mr. Office. Great. I, I wow. want you to relax your feet and take a seat and do your business. <laughs> Mr. Office, we're from Greg T. Dum 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 dum. It is the greatest that you've ever seen. Dum, 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 dum. Barbara, please invest in me. Mr. Office, we're from Greg T. Now, Barbara, to date, since coming up with my concept, I have zero in sales, but I have zero debt. I'm asking for everyone to knock down those cubicle walls and, of course, work from home. So, Barbara, I'm asking you to help me pull that handle and flush your stress away. So, Mr. Office, he yes. wants to do all of his work on the toilet with this desk. Look at this desk he's created. I've recently quit my job at a very popular radio station to uh, pursue my dreams. I think you were fired. I spend nearly five hours a day in a bathroom. And um, I have also a private investor, but he left. Uh, Bob Pittman has oh. invested in Mr. Office. But we need to get to the, you need to describe to Barbara. Maybe, Barbara, you can look at his Mr. Office and describe it yourself. What do you assume this product is? I assume it's a, a toilet bowl. Yes. Uh, a, a table that you pull up to the toilet bowl on an angle with all the necessary it, office tools. Uh, yeah, I would have to say that's what it is. Well, Barbara, I came up with this idea for real 15 years ago. There's not one on the market like it at all. I'm so surprised. It's, I said to it's myself, like a TV dinner tray. I said, Actually, we need, well right, said. Yeah. I need a chair. I, so I have my toilet, so I'm here. And then I said, what if I had a little something next to me? I would just wheel it around and then mm. set it up. And then put my computer on it, mm. and I could, you know, do my stuff, and then, you know, <laughs> oh, God. and at the same time, and there's no, and I can get so much done for. Because it. the door is closed and the door is locked exactly. in a house full of kids, huh, I mean, Mr. I mean, office? Yeah. Think, think about the the big mouth Billy Bass, which brought in over five hundred million dollars. <laughs> the Pet Rock. I mean, last year the Hatchimal. I mean, took everybody by storm. Barbara for twenty four ninety nine. This can be sold at every Walmart and Target across America. I see. Uh, Mr. Office, think? Barbara Corcoran, your thoughts? Uh, I would say I'm definitely out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm even out on that out. What? It's an out can out. I encourage you to sit down and try it out? <laughs> I'll, I'll take a seat. You really want me to? Uh, please. Okay, okay we why will. Not? Okay, oh, wait, we'll wait, do that in a minute. Wait, but wait. So, so why, why would Mr. Office not work? Well, first of all, you would definitely get on Shark Tank because it's so ridiculous. Okay. All right, so there's a plus. And enough people would order it as a goof gift, but it would be a one-time sale. Right. The price is right. Wait, I'm going to give you the good news. The good news is twenty four ninety five is nice. What does it cost you to make that? It looks to me like the... It costs them $28. <laughs> I'm hoping, Barbara, with your contacts, you know, that you can help me out and really, you know, uh, modify how much money I spend on this. Uh, I but doubt I had that. to go to the dollar store for all well, the... Okay, how, yeah, what, yeah, what, yeah. how much did you spend on this, Mr. Office Roughly prototype? 60 bucks. Oh, my God. <laughs> $6 for the toilet seat, 5 bucks for the bucket. $30 I for mean, the stand. You don't need to buy a toilet seat. The toilet's included. The okay. issue is that we all get so distracted when we're working and answering emails, and all yes. of a sudden you have hemorrhoids because you're sitting on the toilet, which is terrible. Which As is you terrible. Can see, though, on my calendar, I have here, right here, meeting with Barbara today at 8.30, and I have over here on Friday cashing my million-dollar check from Barbara on Friday morning. So. You're very hopeful. I like your optimism. I think okay. this is serious. But so if I had to make a serious product out of this, no, I'm being serious now. I mean, it's 
not worth my time or even your time or anyone's time. But as because it rolls, because of the size, because it's on an angle, which makes it easy to write, because you have the sill that catches the pen and the pad so it doesn't slide off, I think it's a great TV stand, a TV working stand to do in front of your TV. But the gimmick of saying you're on the John, of course, is a great marketing ploy to demonstrate it at these trade shows. So People it's laugh and laugh. You can sit on many, many different surfaces, in, surfaces yeah, yeah, yeah. including the toilet seat. So it maybe it the there's subway. something there, but I doubt it very much. As Kevin O'Leary says, I take it behind the barn and shoot it. No! Oh, oh damn! <laughs> well, that's that's the truth here. By the way, she used the word shoot, S-H-O-O-T. Yeah. Uh, can, I, can I get on your home shopping network? <laughs> no, that's Lori Grenier. Let me give you her cell phone right oh, now. Yeah, we have that. <laughs> You can see I can't this. Can't wait to hear from you. Check at Elvis Duran on Instagram if you want to see Mr. Office. Maybe you wish to invest, even the Barbara Corcoran. You know what? You're going to sell some of these, believe it or not, as a result of this show. So get it ready, but but make a cheaper version. You don't want to lose 25 bucks on every one you mail in. I have and there a you garage go. filled with Mr. inventory. Okay, okay, thank you, uh, Mr. Yes, Office. Mr. Barbara Corcoran Woo! is out. Guys, it's cheap. Not really. Last week, ABC revealed Shark Take is renewed for a ninth season, and there's a reason why. We learn and we laugh. We have such a great time watching. And Barbara Corcoran, what an honor to have you here. My pleasure. I want you to Amazon this book today. Got Amazon. What a good idea that was. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> why wasn't that on Shark Tale? <laughs> I don't know. Barbara Corcoran's Shark Tales, How I Turned $1,000 into a Billion-Dollar Business. It's a national bestseller because it's full of great advice for entrepreneurs and for people just getting through life. And don't forget to take my entrepreneur test on BarbaraCorcoran.com. BarbaraCorcoran.com. Don't waste your time if you ain't one of them. And if you're buying an apartment <laughs> in New York City, Corcoran.com as well, even though she doesn't own it anymore. Yeah, I hate to see them get that cash. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, DouglasElement.com. No, 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 no. Don't do that. I'll kill you. X, 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 X. Uh, Barbara Corcoran, thank you so much. Thank you. My pleasure.